What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be working on my Mitsubishi. I'm going to be using that truck bed coating to paint the tire wells. Uh, so real quick, I'm just going to go ahead and lift up the car and remove the back tires. It's going to start off in the back and uh, we'll get started. So I took off both tires. We're gonna start right here in the back. Here's a gallon of the, this is Rust-Oleum truck bed coating. So we're gonna use this. And uh, instead of uh, spraying it on or rolling it on with a roller, we're just gonna use a brush and just dab it right here. There's some overspray from when we painted the car. Um, this piece right here earlier, uh, I washed all this area and uh, I just tried the oops the spray can. This is the Rust-Oleum uh, High Performance Enamel in gloss black. So I washed all this and decided like these metal pieces from right here, control arms or whatever they are, um, just paint them with the spray can. And then these, like the tire wells in here, uh, just use a brush and bed coating. All right, so I went ahead and covered the strut with some brown paper and down here, the wheel spacer also, just a little bit of uh, 3M masking tape, just so I won't get it painted. Uh, the drum, I am gonna paint this with uh, the spray can.
it out. Right here at the drum, I use the spray can. And over here, the control arm, and this uh, this one over here, spray can. The strut, I just left it like that. I just covered it with paper. Um, the rest, right here, everything got covered with uh, that bed coating. I gave it about three coats. The first one was just very light. Um, and then the second and third one, just heavier. That way it can be thick. So I'm gonna leave it like this. Um, till I come back and do the front ones. Here's the other side. The drum looking pretty good. It was all rusty, so this is a huge improvement. Got a little drip right there, <laughs> but not bad. We'll be here. Everything got covered, really nice. Same thing for the strut. Here's a, uh, you know, the spindle, I guess, and the lower control arm. I don't know the proper term for these things, but they're parts of the car. <laughs> Yeah, everything looks really, really nice. And I put the spacers right here on the back tires. I didn't have them. Uh, so I just got them and installed them today. Since I think this side, I was rolling with this uh, cobalt wheel with this, I don't know the size of the tire. It rubbed a little bit. Oops, well it rubbed it on the other side. But I need to get some different wheels or tires or just paint these and just get different tires. But, yep, over here in front, I had already washed it on the inside. Let me see if I could just stick this. It's pretty dark. Now, but I had already washed it, so we, we'll come back on the next video, and or I'll probably just do it off camera. I'll show you guys. That way we can just get rid of this car. Not get rid of it, but be done with. So, everything looking pretty good. <laughs> My daughter over there. Hey, what are you doing? Whoa, what are you doing, Mama? <laughs> watch out, watch out. Whoa, come here. Come here. What are you doing? Look, I got you on camera over here. <laughs> This is my daughter, Genesis. Uh, she turned uh, one year old on the 17th of December. Uh, we just threw her party on the 20th this weekend, so. You gonna close the video, Mama? Goodbye. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you next time. Peace out. <laughs>